Hey guys, Big Bro here, and today I'm going to be doing the second episode of Nerf Thrifting. If you wouldn't know that this is coming out, if you see my update video, if you haven't seen my update video, then you can either go check it out, and then you'll know about the video you already know about. Yeah. But anyway, the first Nerf gun I got was literally a dollar. And it's a Busby gun. That's sh like no barrel length, obviously. See, there's like holes in the sides of each barrel for some reason but it doesn't shoot too bad like it shoots better than it, the, the, the knockoff tech 3 that I have um like it's it's pretty it's pretty neat I thought pull it back look it has a metal priming bar like how cool is that Push it forward fire it rotate manually so it's pretty neat I picked it up for one dollar it's a slow week so far Next, we have probably the second biggest. I picked this up for a dollar. It is a Busby Air Blaster Tommy 20. You know, this is, it's really loud, so brace yourself when I turn it on. The handle is just, no, no, like, it's just a stub, like, like, how are you supposed to figure, I don't know. It's weird, like, you have to do it like this, it's weird, but it works, kind of, you have to be careful not to hit your arm on the drum when you're, when you're holding it, but it's pretty compact, small gun for what it is, it shoots about the same as the other Busby Blaster, I'd say, that I just showed you, it, um, it has the same barrel thing as the Tommy 20 that I have, no, and that I got in my last lifting video. But instead of half trigger pull rev, full trigger pull is the um, firing. You turn it on. Because you can't pull the trigger without turning it on. It's kind of a safety. And then it fires. So I'm going to turn it on. Brace yourselves. Headphone users, beware. It's so loud, but, uh, I don't know, it's, it's neat, it's, I saw one in stores the other day, it was $20, so I figured, hey, I'm glad I picked this up. Next, you've probably already seen my review on, if not, go check it out, the Busby Air Max 10. This, this thing is very inconsistent, I'll tell you that, but most air blasters like this, do not get very good ranges. Me, Mr. Classified and I tested out the, um, not side by side, we used FaceTime. We tested out the uh, ATK234000 <laughs> versus the Air Max 10 here. And, um, I think this, this usually performs better unless some reason it, like, messes up and doesn't even shoot the dart, which happens a few times, like, I'd say twice every 10 darts. You know, you pump it one, two, three, around four times before the OP RV kicks in, and then. Yeah. This is just pretty neat. You don't have to auto rotate it like most Buzzy guns. Of, um, or at least the older and smaller Buzzy guns. Oh, and by the way, I got this for three bucks. Three bucks. Not too bad. Last, we have my favorite, the biggest, Speedload 6. It was primed when I got there. How disappointing is that? Like, it was sitting on the shelf like this. It is, it's pretty weak. It's, it's kind of weak now. Like, it's sad, but how can you pass it up for $2? A Speedload 6. Like, you just can't. The internal mag... The internal magazine is pretty, pretty, pretty cool. Like, you can just load it on the fly, and then it's like, oh no, I'm almost out of darts. You don't have to drop a clip, put a new one, and you just shove darts in there. Keep going. It has one. I think it may be one of the first. I don't know. It, it's one of the older, one of the older blasters to have a slam fire. And it's kind of weird when you come forward. has a first kind of click and then a second one to fire. The first one 
is to close the door of the thing or open the door of the here and then the second one is to fire so it's just like pretty pretty neat I like all these finds were pretty cool four finds for a thrifting video is for me in my area with what three three goodwills that there used to be five two of them closed down or one of them closed down one of them got just like flooded pretty much and yeah that kind of kind of sucks and then there was another thrift store that I usually go to that that moved somewhere I don't know where so it's been it's not been too good of a um, few weeks but next week hopefully I will have some more stuff because Christmas is coming and it usually donate stuff right before Christmas so you know anyway I hope you enjoyed this video make sure to leave a like for the nerf guns and I'll see you guys next time peace